Heat 5 is in the water behind us, so we're going to take you down to the action now as uh, the girls get stuck in. Macy Callahan, Alicia Spencer and Sophie Bell. And, uh, well, the weather's looking glorious down there. A couple of likely-looking lads on the beach throwing the football around. And this is Elisa Spencer from the US. She's from Carlsbad in Southern California. So, nine, nine years. <laughs> Amazing. Here's the replay. This is Macy Callahan, who uh, couldn't really be stopped in Australia this year, just owned the Australian Junior Series. And then, uh, of course, over the back, there's another set of beaches, and uh, you keep on going down to the next town. Here goes Sophie Bell. The South African surfer, she comes from about 40 minutes north of Durban in a place called Salt Rock. So a nice section there and floats it up, up and over that end section. And behind her, this is Alyssa Spencer. We're going to get stuck in that pink board just doing the revolutions there. Unfortunately for the second half of that, with the pilot unattached. And she did everything right up until falling off. You know, she, had, she knew she had to attack that last section. She went for it. Well played, nice little left, open face, good form, good style, waiting for her opportunity here. But that is a tricky closeout, and we've seen it just undo a lot of people all day. I suspect these guys are all going to get a little better on day two, though. Yeah, you think so? A bit of first day nerves? Mm -hmm. and, um, you know, the experience gained from the time in the water will serve everyone well as they go deeper into the draw. All right, here's the replay of Macy Callahan's 5.5. Talk us through it, Chris. Well, you can see she got a little move right off the start, and then it kind of formed up nicely for her on the inside and allowed her that turn right there. And, uh, of note, she's another one of these surfers who's beautifully matched their rash vest with their wetsuit. Her color <laughs> coordination is spot on. Here's the heat leader, Macy Callahan, and uh, she's throwing that one up into the lip and just comes undone right at the finish. And a point seven seven. Here we see Macy Callahan. This is her third wave. She's looking to get rid of that two that's in her scoreline. She's going to stick with it. Gets over a little bumpy section. Hammers a very nice turn there. That was crisp from the Australian Wonder Girl. All Not right, quite we... as beautiful as this, though. Well, this is pretty damn good, isn't it? And what what else is damn good is the last score for Macy Callahan has come in at a 5.53. So that just shades her opening wave as the best scorer of this heat so far. The Australian junior surfer who has just been tearing in 2016 is keeping her run going in 2017 with a 5.5 and a 5.53 to be leading the heat. She's out in front of Sophie Bell from South Africa. And Sophie has a 4.17 and a 1.97. I think we take the top four and then throw in uh, four wild cards as well. Here goes one of the youngest surfers in the draw. This is Lisa Spencer. She it looked like she was attacking the lip with some uh, real aggression there, but in fact she was just pulling the ripcord and getting it out of there. World titles. That, of course, will be presented at the WSL Awards Night on the Gold Coast in a couple of months' time. And here's one girl who would love nothing more than to be up there on the podium with um, Tyler Wright, and that's Macy Callahan. Here's the replay. Yeah, you see, she just got out in the open face. The wave kind of went flat on her right there. She was hoping for a, a little bit more of a vertical off the top and then hesitated just a bit too much on that closeout section. At the Quicksilver Pro, here's Elisa Spencer, youngest girl in the draw, I think, and she is working her way down the line. Big section coming up, blasts it, releases the tail. That was nicely done. And, uh, well, shows some strength to right out of that. And she's not done yet. She's going to keep milking this one for all it's worth. She's got a nice little reform on the inside and bashes it out again. So a handful of turns there from Alyssa Spencer. Turf, it's a big one. You see this nice left opened up in front of her. Good opportunity there. Beautiful sweeping little carve to start. And then just right into that closeout section, lays into it and hangs on through that tricky foam section. And then gets the bonus little reform right here. And kind of let her do a little foam climb on the inside and opened up and got one extra move. So that's going to be a good scoring ride. Yeah, absolutely. And really showing some maturity. That would have been those extra little turns down the line were plenty to keep banking her points. Now we see Macy Callahan. She's skating over. She's had a bit of dead water. This wave looks like it might open up for her. She wants to start getting active, releases the tail there. I think it'll just be the one turn 
Hawks so far in this heat, opening up with Macy Callahan. This was a 5.5. She kept it on rail. She just kept that board moving and uh, just eating up sections and, and finishing off in some style. Talk us through the second wave, Chris. Yeah, this was the left. A little tricky right there. Got a little hung up, but then worked for the inside section and, and slammed oh. that one. The judges like that. Far away. Big fan. Of course, Alyssa Spencer. This was her best ride. Nice sweeping carve. And then this thing opened up for her. She got the closeout maneuver right here and then found a beautiful little reform on this thing. They pushed her right into it right there. You see another little foam climb. So that was her highest scoring wave, which was a 5.87. Actually, the highest scoring ride of the entire heat right now. So she's within striking distance. Looks like Sophie having a look. Yeah, she's a long way back. And uh, what's this wave going to serve up for her? Not a lot. So she's uh, going to try and get out the back again. We see Macy Callahan having a look, deciding she wasn't interested. Here goes Elisa Spencer. And uh, well, she started off going right. Now she's gone back to her forehand and crunched that section. So that was beautifully done. Well, let's not forget she has been surfing for nine years. <laughs> A like whopping nine years, yeah. Look at that inside wow, section. Wow, she really hammered that turn. It was beautiful. She connected, so good job. So just short. So still chasing at 5.16. Here goes Macy Callahan with 16 seconds to go. She's looking to really shut the door on this one. And uh, she's done it very nicely, punctuating her heat with some big turns through to the inside. And she's pretty much going to kick out on the sand as the hooter goes. And we see her stepping off into a foot of water and by the sounds of things stepping off straight into round three quick look at the watch yep job well done yeah I'm nice little here. victory lap wave for macy on that one and she did she surfed that one well that was perfectly to the criteria good moves speed flow power the whole nine